A soldier is an extremely arrogant, gun-wearing punk. They believe he is superior to other citizens. He think he deserves special privileges because he protects old men's and women's fortune and protects old greedy patriarchy. He thinks he is glorious because he goes to other countries with no too little defense and steal their country's profits like oil, diamonds and food. In all the extremely hypocritical peace wars so euphemistically they're called The media is the most powerful entity on the earth. The media controls the minds of the masses, and that's power. Because the media controls the minds of the masses, and that's power. I don't view the way we be programmed to think about the so-called glorious man and woman that fight for our nation. When they're in reality being in other countries playing the Vendetta Warriors <laughs> more of I to say in the Chilensis. Because when the military come there, they don't hold them on the laws of their lands. And therefore, all military people are being vigilantes. People that take the law in their own hands. Oh yeah, you have also to not forget that military people are being brainwashed. To think they're being superior on others. Because some crazy, arrogant cunt that lets you kill rabbits to prove that you are one man. Say it. That also don't skin hold his mouth for one second. On less than hardcore for for um version, you only can scream in your face. You not can even talk normal. So why you then think that some person like that deserve respect? Imagine that it is your father. Think you that some father that's Screaming in the face of his children deserve any respect? If you say Now! Come on! One time more! I can I say you can do it! And if you can do it! You have one more person! When I say to you back! Is that some parents? Or mentor that you think that deserve any respect? I think not, actually. Military people are maybe mo one of the most arrogant and foolish people on earth. One, only a miserable fool. I have nothing to be proud of. Try to find the last resort proud in the nation where he is born. He is ready and happy to protect all his foolish, all his imperfections, 
all his mistakes, tears and news, in order for his own insecurity. Come on. You are not so... You are not supposed to be so full with patriotism that you are not to face reality. When one nation with far more military advancements go into other countries and kill their others, children, house parents, they are for, before they are killed. How can you ever find glory in such thing like that? So don't be so gullible to slick marketing propaganda and PR shit from some business like the military or the police force or the government in general. Government is a full of shit. Extensing full of shit. And don't be so proud of my country. And I also know a lot of people from other countries are not so proud of their country. Because they're being wise. They're being not the house in nigger. As Malcolm X say in his speech. The house nigger also talks in this way. The house nigger say, our country. They are saying not the country. The house sneaker also say the. He say he say also our plantation on the time of the slavery. He say not the plantation. That's what the field nigger say. The wise nigger. And that's also the thing that the. More than Uncle Sam and Uncle Tom said. Uncle Sam was also a um, filthy motherfucker. He was a flash inspector. An animal flash inspector. Maybe that's the reason that you're so... F have so much fetish for animal body parts, America. And have the highest chance of all major diseases in the Western world. From cancer to diabetes, to heart attacks and strokes. From osteoporosis. Etc. And etc. These are the top 15 causes the, of death, the f top 15 reasons Americans die. And a plant-based diet can help prevent nearly all of them, can help treat more than half of them, and in some cases even reverse the progression of disease, including our top three killers. Now, there are drugs that can help too. Right? You can take one drug to treat uh, cholesterol, every day for the rest of your life, another drug for blood sugars, uh, a few more pills for, uh, for, your, for your blood pressure. The same diet, though, does it all, right? It's not like, you know, one diet for this and then a different diet for this, right? One diet to rule them all. <laughs> and what about drug side effects? Right? I'm not talking about a little rash or something. Prescription drugs kill more than 100,000 Americans every year. And I'm not talking about medication errors, not abuse, not overdose. We're talking, this is just deaths from side effects, so-called ADRs, adverse drug reactions to prescription. Fuck your patriotism. We have to eliminate nationalism and become earthlings.
And as earthlings, we have to understand that all the other animals on this planet are also a fellow earthlings. And not toys. Not inanimate objects. But fellow earthlings. In the splendor that we call life and earth. Life on earth. I say, all countries on the world, stop you mistaxing and wasting billions and billions and billions and billions of dollars any year in military. America, something like 600 billion um, dollars. And here, that's what they give to the military. Imagine. It can do. Stop extremely subsidizing this legal assassins. In order of the states. Because that is what the military will actually be. They have been a bunch of uniformed legal assassins in name of the status quo. Just like when the FBI in 90. It was. When they dropped a bomb on the the uh, when they had a drop and bomb of the house of move and this uh, kill a lot of um, cats and dogs and kill their leader of this black Pythagoras Quakers. Don't be the fool. I say you, don't be the fool. We need not more Aminis. We need last Umini. So and we have to become vegan. Because a contrary which most people believe the whole Mimi species are fruity force or starchy force. We are not anatomical and physiological designed carnivores or omnivores. Because when human or humani actually eats animal products that will paralyze our liver so that we our liver don't produce insulin anymore, it will Clog our arteries so that we get heart attacks and strokes. And um, will 